I am asked every single day, how do you make my outfit in GTA? So here's how you guys do it. So first things first, we're going to start with this outfit and work our way up to this outfit and show you guys how to get every single clothing item. So once you guys have an outfit that you want to turn into mine, go to this specific clothes store on the map right here. We're going to start off by getting the tan joggers right there. It's actually super easy. So first things first, head to your interaction menu, go down to preferences right here, go down even more to map blimp options, go to jobs and make sure they're all on show. Once they're all on show, you guys will see a job that's right here next to this clothes store. Also, don't mind that guy. He just tripped. He's fine. Now, once you guys see this job pop up here, go to interaction menu again. Go to register a boss, register a CEO, start an organization. Now, go back to your interaction menu. Go to your CEO. Go to management. Head down to style. And then switch your outfit to the warlord outfit. It should be over here just a little bit. Right here, the warlord outfit. As you guys can see, it has the tan joggers on it. Now, once you guys have this outfit and you guys are CEO, enter this job right here by clicking right in the D-pad in this blue circle, just like that. Now, load it into the job and confirm all settings click play there we go launch the job on your own yes once you guys get into this screen right here just cycle between all your bikes for about 10 to 15 seconds or so now once you cycle between all of them for a little while click quit confirm the job yep once you load back in you will not have the outfit on but just head inside the clothes store right here tap right in the d-pad at this counter right here and just wait a second should take about 15 to 30 seconds and the outfit will just randomly spawn in just watch this there we go. It kicks you out of that little menu. And there you go. You have the outfit on just like that. Don't know how that works, but it's super weird. Now you can disband the CEO just like that. And you'll keep the outfit as you guys can see. So head over here, go to the counter, and then you can save the outfit in the slot you want to. Now you have tan joggers saved. And that's honestly one of the hardest parts. The next part's super easy. So next thing, head over here to this counter right here, which is tops. Then go down to number 41 designer hoodies. And then go to number 48 chocolate blaggerist hoodie. I think that's how you say it. I don't know for sure, but that's the hoodie on the outfit right there. But don't leave tops yet. Head down to number 59 utility vest. And now select number 43 peach plate carrier right here. Now you have the vest over the hoodie. And this only works on male characters. This is a different way to do it for female characters. If you guys want that tutorial, let me know. But there you guys go. As you guys can see, the outfit is coming together. So let's get the shoes next. Head over to this counter right here. Now head down to skate shoes number three. And then go down to number 14 tan skate shoes. Just right there. There we go. Now head over to this wall right here. It's accessories. Click right on the D-pad. Head down to gloves. And get the peach digital armor gloves number 45. As you guys see, the outfit's really coming together now. It's pretty easy. Next. Head over to this little sunglass thing over here and then click right in the d-pad now we're gonna go down to sports glasses number two and then you need sports glasses number 23 there we go just like that now once you guys get this outfit to this state right here you can leave the clothes store we need to go to the weapon store next you're all done with the clothes store though now just up the street from that clothes store is a weapon shop right here just head in here really quick now head into the front counter and head over to parachutes up here click on parachute and go to parachute bag go to number i believe it's six tan combat shoot bag just like that now once you guys equip that go to interaction menu go down to appearance parachute and make sure it's equipped it on there you go now you have the parachute and now it's the hardest part the mask and the helmet which is hard now because rockstar patched the telescope glitch but that's no big deal there's a workaround for it now this workaround for the telescope glitch is working as of july 18 2024 but if you guys are watching this way later than that and it's been patched for some reason because rockstar likes to patch harmless glitches you can still get this outfit all the way to this point you just might have to do just the goggles and just the helmet but i'll be sure to show you guys how to do that as well after you equip the parachute head down to the mask store right here on the beach if you guys don't know where it's at it's right there now head over here to the left counter right here click right on the d-pad and head down to i believe it is combat helmets number 22 right there and now you want to buy number 37 peach digital quad lens right there now if the telescope glitch is patched the outfit is done you just don't need the mask the outfit is pretty much done here but if you guys want to get the mask and the telescope glitch isn't patched here's how you do it so first things first if you guys do want to get the mask click right on the d-pad at the right counter right here and then head down to ski masks number 17 and then buy number 43 desert camo spec ski right there as you guys can see the entire outfit is complete besides the goggles so you guys can leave the outfit like this or you can leave it like how it was before with just the goggles without the mask but if you guys want to do the goggles over the mask here's how you do it with the new updated telescope glitch so what you guys to do to get the goggles in this outfit is actually super simple but you need any property in the game that has a bed that's not an apartment so i chose to go to my agency right here on the map so just head into my agency right now once you guys are in the property that has the bed make sure you have just the helmet and just the mask on head over to the bed right here and click right in the d-pad to lay down as you guys can see your character will take off the helmet and the mask give them a second and there we go. Now, once you're laying in bed, click pause, head over to online, and just scroll through all these little menus once, just down like this. There we go. Now, you guys should be able to open up your interaction menu just like that. There we go. Now, once you're in your interaction menu, head over to appearance, head over to accessories. Make sure you equip the glasses we talked about earlier, the brown urban ski, just like that. Once you guys have the glasses, just click circle, head out. And then exit out of the bed just like this. Click triangle. There we go. And walk over here to your wardrobe nearby. The agency works best for this. Head into your wardrobe. Click right on the D-pad. Click circle. And then right in the D-pad again. Just like that. There you guys go. Now you'll see you have all three of them on. Now you can hit into outfits. 
and then outfit saved. Then you guys can save it over the outfit that you want to save it over. So this one right here, we're just going to edit save outfits right here. And then boom, and save it as whatever outfit you want. There you go, boom. Now the outfit is officially saved. You might, your character might take the parachute off. You can just equip that in the interaction menu again. Sometimes that happens no matter what with my outfit. It's just kind of how it is. I don't know why they do that. Let's say you go from your normal outfit to this one all the way up to my outfit just like that in 2024. There's the updated outfit tutorial. I know a lot of you guys have been asking about this. It took a little while to figure out what glitches work the best to make this work the most efficiently. There you guys go. There's my outfit tutorial. I appreciate you guys watching. If you guys have any questions, let me know in the comments. Now, shout out to Casey as well for teaching me some of these glitches to get the outfit set up all, uh, all good for you guys.